Hey everybody, this is Dan Jones Burr coming back at you Saturday, February 2nd, 2013 with another video. And uh, this video is basically going to be about um, the black female who was tased down in Atlanta by the security guard. And, but before I give my thoughts on, you know, what I feel about her being taped, I figured I would share a quick story with you. About uh, last year, um, I went to a nice uh, restaurant on the uh, west side of Atlanta. And uh, there were a lot of affluent people in this restaurant. You know, um, the restaurant had a lot of money in it. So when I was leaving the restaurant, I was in the company of two other people. Uh, we were waiting for our car to come from, from the valet. And um, I saw this uh, these two black women, and they had uh, three little kids with them. And I was not right up on them when I initially saw them. I was a little ways off. And, uh, but... I heard the one young woman, she was very upset and crying, and basically telling one of the patrons of the restaurant that, uh, that you know, uh, you think you got it all, and, you know, uh, if you was in this situation, you wouldn't, you know, look down your nose at me, and, you know, she was real upset. So as they got closer to me, I noticed that they were begging and they had bags in their hands, and one of the sisters came up to me. They were young, and the children were young, too, and it was kind of cold. Um, and she told me, she said, uh, uh, our apartment just burned up. Um, all we have is what we have in our hands. And the little kids were in their pajamas, and she was visibly upset. So I gave her money, and I won't disclose how much money I gave her, but the people that I was with were, were disagreeing with me uh, about giving the money. But I gave the money anyway because this is the type of guy I am. And I didn't give the money because she was begging me. I gave the money because I looked at the children. And, you know, there are a lot of people laughing uh, about this young lady getting tased down in Atlanta. And I did watch the video because I initially didn't want to watch the video, but then I clicked on some of the video and they had it on there. But I'm not really interested in watching that kind of stuff. But um, when I watched the video about the young woman who was acting belligerent who got tased down in Atlanta, the only thing I saw was the impact of first her behavior on her child and then what happened to her on her child. And I looked at that young boy running to his mother because it's not that child's fault that his mother first acted like that. Second, it's not his fault that she was going up on the security guard. And thirdly, it's not his fault for being traumatized by what the security guard did to his mother. So I didn't look at it like it was funny because to me it wasn't funny. Because, you know, uh, there are a lot of children, just like those small children that I saw that night, that were forced to beg in the streets with their mother. It was not their choice to beg in the street with their mother. And sometimes you have to show empathy towards children and not the adults in the situation. For someone to think that the video was so hilarious, they're only empathizing with the male adult that actually tased the female, and they're totally removing the child from the equation. And I just don't agree with that. I'm not saying this to uh, slight anyone. I'm not saying this to, uh, you know, to make anyone feel bad. But a lot of times we talk about problems within our communities, but then we totally overlooked the obvious. 
and the obvious is uh, situations like this, like this, are the reason why our children grow up to be the way they are, and the reason why a lot of times we're often often victimized by these children who grow up to be murderers and killers. So peace out, and that's just my commentary on the woman getting taged.